All right. Here we go. We got a best of five between Flitz and Hazo. Hazo's going to strike first. Just lofts one up to the backboard. Flitz in an awkward spot. Couldn't make the read. Congrats with auction making it to London. Man, thank you. Thank you. I know the players are excited. I'm excited to see them play, and there's even a chance for Worlds, so... Super pumped about it. Hazo, two straight, right off of kickoff. Great start to game one in the series, of course. See if Flitz can make an adjustment. Looks for bounce dribble. Can't get it past Hazo. Hazo knows he's got him on low boost. Just going to keep keep pestering him. See if he can keep this ball active in the blue side. Hazo does have the reset. Uses it for a wave dash catch. Just patiently waits. Flitz has actually done well to dispossess him. Another flick. Flitz relying on the ground game thus far. An overextension from Hazo will provide Flitz with a free counterattack opportunity. Easy peasy. Flitz puts his first on the board. A lot of time left in the first game. Air dribble from Flitz. Test the defense of Hazo. He's up for the test. Blitz. Oh. Looks for maybe a near post play. Hazo has it red and defended. Flit reset. Can't get the flick. And now Flitz should have his second. And we've seen this twice now. And there's actually been a couple other opportunities as well. Hazo certainly playing aggressive on the offensive side. Wow. Can't work it inside. Can't work it inside the frame, and Flitz actually going to steal possession after grabbing the corner boost. It's a nice outplay from Hazo, but... The recovery was just a bit too awkward, so no goal there. Flitz may have another opportunity. Can't get the power on the shot, so we stay locked at Saw first touch. Blitz will pull in for the challenge. That's a fantastic save from Hazo. Had to challenge from behind and even underneath Blitz. But as they both made contact with the ball, he pinched it away. Hazo will turn things around, put in his third. Awkward situation there in the orange box, but Hazo manages to survive. In fact, he begins the counterattack, but Flitz hustles back. Gets the demo, lands a reset, and he'll turn it into a scoring opportunity. Flitz puts in his third.
Nice read on the corner bounce. Flitz. Good for a fourth. I think that is just inside the post. So Flitz, once again, able to punish the overextension from Hazo, who, who has a tendency, or has shown a tendency throughout this first game, to maybe be a bit overaggressive. Uh oh. Do we see the clock run out? 50 seconds. Nope. <laughs> Hazo's out of it. Flitz says no. And the reset musty is no good. Hazo will be punished once more. <laughs> Blitz has some choice words for Hazo. Just a little extra context. This was I messaged Flitz about playing today, and he uh, specifically suggested him versus Hazo, so I'm sure that these guys are buddies and we'll probably do a little yapping about the match. Hazo, air dribble flip reset. It's good for a fourth. He's got to make two goals happen here in the final 18 seconds. Certainly not impossible, but won't be easy either. May have another opportunity here to the backboard. Looks for the dunk. A precious time off the clock. If he can hustle this infield, he may have an opportunity. In fact, the 50 goes off the post. And Hazo puts in a fifth. Hold on, we've got three seconds left. What can he cook up? Hold on. Fake kickoff from Flitz or delayed. Red well by Hazo. But Flitz... Knocks it to the ground. Secures the first victory in the series. Blitz a low and slow ground play. We'll find the far post. And he'll be the one to strike first in game two. Blitz is going to maintain possession. Pull things back to his own side. He's sent the clear past Hazo. Has the follow-up rebound as well. See what Hazo has in store. Low altitude flip reset. Musty flick attempt. No good. Flitz will walk in another one. And the trend continues. Hazo. Throwing out some ambitious attempts on offense. That do, unfortunately, cost him to concede on the defensive side. Now Flitz with a big challenge win there. In the orange side. Towards him with another easy opportunity. Hazo should be putting in his first challenge win to follow the kickoff. Blitz again. Holds strong on defense. And walks home a counterattack. Oh. 
Blitz bonked it off the crossbar. He's going to have to pull back the defense. He's actually get, gets another opportunity. Lands the flip reset and finds the near post. Blitz takes advantage of the space. Great patience from Hazo this time. Bounce dribble is the choice of attack. Just enough hesitation to make Flitz second guess. Hazo gets a third on the next kickoff. Let's cut the lead down to three. Huge. I mean, that's a ground pinch. I don't know if y'all see the way that Hazel strikes this. <laughs> what a powerful shot. He's got a fourth that he slams home from his own corner. Blitz will get possession this time. 250 on the clock. Blitz wanted to slow it down, but Hazel had it red to perfection. Takes the ball right off the top of Flitz and knocks home a fifth. Nice play from Hazo, who has just turned this game on its head. Blitz got off to such a hot start. I think it was 6-1 to one at one point. And Hazo said enough is enough. Turns on overdrive and mounts the comeback. Got possession here of the, the boost. So Flitz with... Zero in the tank, throws a decent shot towards the target, but it's never going to go in. Hazo positioned well for it. This time, Flit secures all the boosts on his path back to his own side. And we see once again, the script has flipped. Hazo securing boost, pushing Flitz back to the final corner. And now Flitz has finally stopped the bleeding and put in a seventh goal for himself. We've actually got almost two minutes left to play. Defense, maybe not up to par today. Both sides having plenty of success on the offensive end. Hazo will put in a seventh himself. It's a great demo, but Flitz can't get back to the ball. <laughs> he did so well to get rid of Hazo and not hit the ball, which I think many of us can relate to. Um, you know, many times I will land the demo, but also own goal. And if you're going to own goal, then obviously it doesn't work. So Flitz, he did a good job there to take out the opponent, but unfortunately still couldn't make the save. Hazo with a quick turnaround. Puts in a ninth. They'll have possession on the next kickoff. Opportunity for a tenth. Early reset. 
Blocked away by Flitz. Azo gives him the what a save. Azo looking for a ceiling pinch. Not going to find it. Has to hustle back to defense. Flitz to the backboard. It's open. Can he drill it? No. Sends the shot wide. Blitz is going to be frustrated with that one. That could have been the goal that he needed. See how these final 40 seconds play out. Hazo with control. Just running this clock down. Blitz has earned himself a possession. What does he do? Off the left wall. Early reset. Fakes the musty and lets the ball bounce in. Smart play from Flitz. Showing that Musty force Hazo up in case he does get the scoop. And then Flitz knows once Hazo's jumped, he can't really make any adjustments. So he just lets the ball bounce its way in. 8-9. Flitz, long shot. Blocked away. Hazo with possession. He goes up high. Wisely brings it back down to the ground. Absorbs a challenge and knocks in a tenth. And as I was saying that, I'm sitting there thinking all about game one. Hazo's been overly ambitious, a bit aggressive or, or too risky on offense. And hey, obviously there's nothing wrong with that, but it did cost him game one. I thought we might see it again there to close out game two. But even without it, Flitz has still found a way to put in a ninth. He's still got some work to do. Three seconds left. He's down one. Hazo does keep this alive. Flitz. Has control. Brings it to his corner, but Hazo steps in, grabs the boost, and knocks it to the ground. Hazo ties up the series. Game number three. Blitz has the first possession, sets up a hook shot. Bates Hazo into positioning for that save. Tries for something different, but ultimately can't put the play together. He's got a clean setup off the right wall. Going for the ceiling reset. Holds the dodge. Hold on. This is a very creative, <laughs> creative choice. Blitz just sits behind the ball. And then the backflip shot at ground level. Seems to catch Hazo off guard. Hazo does respond immediately with the next possession. He's off the left wall, has the reset. Hold on now, the double. Lifts it up over the top of Flitz. Hazo survives on the goal line. And then an aggressive dive will probably cost him. Flitz collects, controls, and knocks in a second. Whoa. Nice flick from Flitz. Slots that into the top corner. Blitz. <laughs> Looking for a demo. Can't find the demo. Looks for a shot. Can't make contact on the shot, but it's all good. The ball heads into the back of the net either way. Flitz, another fantastic start here in game three. 
We'll see if he can hold the lead this time. This time we notice Hazo did not make use of the dodge that he earned from that flip reset. Instead, played it safe. Goes for the full field air dribble. This time he does initiate that dodge. And the result is the same. He's unable to hustle back in time. We got just under three minutes on the clock and Blitz has another 6-1 lead. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Both players a little out of control. Blitz. <laughs> Fortunate that Hazo's recovery was quite slow. He gets a seven. Hazo from his backboard. Lands on the ceiling. Can't get the ideal control on the ball. So instead, takes to the corner. Hunts for a demo. And after deleting Flitz, just walks in his second. That's a nice bit of control there from Flitz. Lifts this up off the wall in the corner. Uses that dodge perfectly. And with the air dribble, he puts in an eight. Little mistake on the kickoff. We'll provide Hazel with an opportunity. Can't get it on frame, so we'll back off to the midfield. Flitz accidentally hands over possession, so Hazel has a third. This time, Flitz has done a better job of, of managing the clock. We've already got under two minutes. Not only has he done a better job of managing the clock, but he's also added to his lead. He's got eight. Blitz with a fake. He's going to let this fall near post. And that's that. We've got a go next call from Hazo. We're going to run this clock down and conclude game three. Keep Hazo from scoring at such a fast rate. Allowed him to hold on to that, uh, like I said, hold on to that and even extend the lead. Leading to a victory there. Flitz is now on match point. And he's right back to work. A couple of outplays in his own side of the field. Works the ball around Hazo and gets the first for game four. Delay kickoff from Hazo. I like that if you can't get anything working post kickoff. See if you can maybe gain yourself an advantage with a kickoff set piece. Hazo, a decent attempt. That's not going to spawn in time. It will on the second loop. In fact, he doesn't get it then either. Flitz barrels in for a challenge. Steals the boost and knocks the ball towards the target, but Hazo resets, grabs his back corner boost, and begins the attack. Now Flitz, zero boost, looking to go the other way. Quick backflip challenge from Hazo. Will dispossess, and he gets his first. 50 seconds in, and we're tied 1-1.
Hazo daring Flitz to challenge, and we see why. Once Flitz dives out of the net, Hazo can just 50-50. Earns himself an open opportunity. He's got two. Hazo needs to be careful here. He's actually done a phenomenal job securing both of the back corner boosts and avoiding being bumped or demoed. At least to a degree that would cost him. Blitz is going to have to back off. Hazo has really picked up the pace here. And that one touch on the air dribble is going to be enough. Hazo gets a third. And a fourth. This has been such an interesting series. We've had a couple of high scoring games, a couple of big momentum swings. And now things have just flipped upside down. This time it's Hazo going out to the early lead. Aggressive. That's an aggressive boost grab from Hazo. I don't really know why he felt the need to sneak over to the midfield boost. Maybe he thought the trip up was enough. But he had some boost. Definitely had a path back to net to grab some more pads. But instead swung out wide and left an opportunity for Flitz to take the shot. So he did. Flitz. Down by two. Looking for the air dribble bump. And he nails it. Flitz. Puts in a third. Nice pinch. Smart play from Flitz. T puts a shot directly on target. Does test Hazo. No luck, though. Flitz maintains possession. Looks for another bump. He gets it, but the shot bounces off the crossbar and out. Flitz is there for the rebound. So with 154 on the clock, Flitz has tied things up once again. Very well done by Flitz. Had such a perfect read on this. He knew Hazo was going to have to push this deep into the corner, which would therefore roll up into the position where Flitz is waiting. He's earned himself a fifth. Has a lead here with 90 seconds left to play. That is magnificent control from Hazo. Gets the early flip reset. And just holds that ball there. Has a couple different options. He can backflip, flick that. Of course, he can forward dodge like we saw. Blitz, just a, a difficult job there defensively. Hazo with a kickoff goal. We'll put in a sixth. And now he's got the lead. Another quick swing. Can Hazo hold the lead? He's got a minute 15. We've seen early in the series some ambitious aerial plays on offense, but this time he keeps it low. And a cut back to the near post is good enough to outplay Flitz. That is incredible control. He's got a three-goal lead. 70 seconds. 
Blitz will have possession here. Hazo's done well to stick around and delay things for Flitz. Standard air dribble. Met by Hazo. Challenging from the ceiling. A quick turn. Fires towards the target. Gets a ninth. And now we've got a next from Flitz. Both of them. Going next here in the middle of the series. And I got some bad news for them. Folks, there's no more next. It's game five. Hazo is going to start things with a quick goal in game five. Only taking him four seconds. Flicks that to the top shelf with the back of the car. Great start for Hazo. Another big kickoff win. What does he do? Ops for the boost. Now Flitz will have control. Hazo. He and Flitz both a bit awkward. And now you can see Hazo a little more a little more careful and calculated with his movement. Doesn't want to swing out for the big boost what? unless he knows he has time. Air roll shot. For Hazo is good. 2-0. Bounce dribble. Hazo's got Flitz on the back foot. Decides to stick around rather than go get boost. Slams that shot to the far side. And he's got a third. Lots of time on the clock. Flitz is going to have to do something about this kickoff. Hazo grabbing possession after each and every kickoff. Flitz just cannot get any boost. Hazo knows that he's going to try for an air dribble. No luck this time, and he does manage to pick up the midfield boost as well. Now Flitz finally got a big corner. He's going to have to make a play here. He's done well. He's got some space. Plenty of boost in the tank as well. Early reset. Another fake from Flitz. Hazo gets a piece of it. But can't get back in position for the second save. Flitz gets his first goal of game five. Wow, nice shot from Flitz. Had to hustle to get back to that play. Get back to that touch before Hazel did. But he's cut the lead down to one. And he's got a possession. Just like we have seen throughout this entire series, back and forth between these two players. Flitz with a very creative pre-flip flick shot. It's not going to work out. Now Hazo has possession. Back from his own side. Has a full tank of boost. And the reset. He's going to play it safe. Blitz, flick, blocked. Does secure the corner. And regain possession. <laughs> what a creative choice there. Blitz, again, just kind of waiting until the ball is almost there at the ground. Dodging at ground level. And works that around the challenge. He gets a third. Now Hazo... And Flitz are tied. Flitz rips a shot towards the targets off the post and out. Does have the corner boost. Early reset. Hazo's full as well, but Hazo crawling up along the backboard and then down the other side. Just puts himself in too awkward of a position. Flitz knocks it to the top shelf. And he's got a lead. Now Hazel will have possession. 
Flit sticks around, throws one towards the target. Shot from the midfield, blocked by Flitz. Hazel grabs the boost. What a wonderful read. Execution on the outplay, phenomenal as well. Hazel knows. He sees Flitz turn towards him. He knows he's going to challenge, so he quickly pops it up over the top. And he's got a fourth. Hazel. Follows it up with a kickoff goal. He's got a fifth. Hazel. Really kind of just gets a gift from Flitz. Big miss there. But he's got two minutes to recover. Oh, no. Blitz missed a couple opportunities, and Hazo's going to walk this home for a seventh. That has got to be frustrating. Still lots of time left. Blitz is going to have to shake it off. Done well on the following kickoff. Plenty of boost in the tank. Air dribble bump attempt. Hazel actually goes underneath, but Flitz with a quick recovery. Turns and taps in a fifth. Flitz showing the ground pinch. Doesn't have it. Hazo's off the post. Flitz has the read on the clear. Can keep this low. Looks for the bump. Can't make contact. Now Hazo the other way. Slots home in eighth. Got 62 seconds to play. Flitz entering desperation territory. Big kickoff win from Hazo. Blitz is on zero inside his own net. He's done well to control this. That's a good flick on target, but it's never going to make it home. Blitz, another flick. And this time it does. That's a delayed flick. I think Hazo maybe thought that Blitz had lost the dodge by that point. Flitz still has life. He's up off the ceiling. Good setup. Holds the dodge for just a moment too long. And Hazo secures that back corner boost. Flitz will be conceding a ninth. And he calls GG's. Hazo will take the victory in five.